I'm Emily. Hi, I'm Audrey. And this is Dad. And this is good questions for Mom. Happy Halloween in 24 days. I'll take this off. Is that better? The classic Michael Myers. Classic Robin Hood. Doesn't talk. Did you get that? I don't think he ever says a word in any of the movies. He goes like, <laughs> Yeah, he just Not runs even when he's a kid. Not even when he's a kid, either. I don't think he's a kid, either. It's funny that you mentioned that, Emily. Because I noticed the other day you came around the corner and you said, Dad, it's only 24 more days until Halloween. We need to start watching movies. What are the best Halloween movies to watch? And I said, daughter, eldest, that's a good question for dad. So what I thought today we would do would give you guys a little uh, top 10. Marco. Gosh, this game again, we're not swimming. Daddy, you should try um, um, popcorn covered coffee. Popcorn covered coffee. We're not playing a game. This isn't really so. a challenge, but this shouldn't be too bad. Ooh. Gonna try popcorn. I've had it better. I've had coffee better by itself, and I've had popcorn better by itself. I'll stick to that. Oh, had it? All right. Does this so, come off? No, no, it does. Too. Did it work? You drinking? Oh, that's gross. Yeah. Okay. Cool. All right, so what we're going to do today is I'm going to give you guys my top ten Halloween movies of all time. That's why I don't want food. So, which is like a first for YouTube, I'm sure. Oh, jeez. That's just what you need is caffeine. All right, well, let's start. Oh, let's kick it off. Number ten, The Goonies. Oh, that's good. Which, yeah, it's a good question, Andre. Because when I thought of my top ten list, for some reason I had to put Goonies on here. I don't. I'm, it's set in the fall. There is some scary. There are some scary scenes. There are dead pirates. Spoiler alert. I guess I should have said at the beginning of the, of spoiler the show. Alert. These spoiler are alert. alert. I may. I may spoil some things for you. And we'll try and not to. Some of those things on the on the front cover will be a little scary. Yes. Um, viewer discretion. Like is advised on all of these, but if you really want to do something sick, what you do is you take your, your five and six year olds and make them watch some of these movies and put like tape on their eyes like this. Why? So you're forced to watch some of these movies, which are can get a little frightening. You could do what this, is. duh. You could do that, duh. Duh. I've seen you do that move. So Goonies. I gotta give them top top ten. I mean, there's there are dead pirates. There's a scary like chunk guy. They eat candy bars. It's set in the fall. I, I well, we haven't actually watched it this year. But and the movies, I, I I bet you I'd probably be like the fat one because I eat all the time. Got number nine on the list. I wonder what they look like now. Young Frankenstein. Frankenstein. That's a weird movie. It is a classic movie. Mel Brooks. Space balls made one died. of my top ten Didn't movies of all time too. This guy. That's a good question that I don't know the answer to. It would make sense that he would kind of be close to dying. But this is a the comedy. Um, there are many, did. many Frankenstein movies. This is the only uh, Frankenstein. Wait, wait, wait! I'm introduction. I meant to do this when I came in. Hi, I'm Audrey. Meant she meant to do that. Mm -hmm. So if you want to rewind the movie, the, the episode, back to the beginning and kind of splice it, that would work. Number eight on my all time 10 list of Halloween movies. Be Be guys. Let's, let's, not mess, let's not mess around, Audrey. Be 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 it's showtime. Um, this one is a comedy slash scary part. There are some scary scenes in this. When he I, like the part when it, I like the part when he gets down the tree. That's funny. 
Yeah, so mad. Yeah, yeah. You gotta be careful. This guy is not a good dude. Definitely. Although, Michael Keaton, where have you been? Right? Am I right, Michael Keaton? Where have you been? Am I right? I don't know. What, what movies has he been that I've seen? <laughs> I don't even remember either. He was uh, Mr. Mom. <laughs> and Tony Lola? Oh, wait, no, that's, no, that's well, the judge. That, I don't the even judge know if he ever He probably up. hosted a show. But Michael Keaton. Um, Mr. Mom? A Mr. Mom. I can remember that one. Yeah, exactly. I'm sure there's other ones too. I'm not the biggest movie and what, buff. And That's what? why my top ten is highly rated because I'm not a movie guy. So if I'm willing to watch a movie, it better be good. That's we, what you should do. We might go to the friend request. And that's what's up. Number seven. That's a weird movie too. The it's Blair Witch Project. That's pretty freaky. Um, now this one is definitely. I saw this a last year for the movie. first time. And if you suffer from any kind of motion sickness or vertigo, don't watch it. Don't watch this one. Why? It's a good question. Because it's set as a set as a documentary style. So their cameras move a bunch and it's like one This is sort of based on a true story. No, that that's Isn't the it? funny thing. When this came out, I can remember I was in college. When this movie came and out, and the girl, her snot was coming out, and those yes, and guys. but but it was the f first movie to use the internet as a sort of marketing campaign, in which the, the back then the internet we had to go to the library. I didn't have the internet in college, like sitting at, at my. I didn't have a computer in my room at all. Nobody did. You had to go to the you had to go to the library to use the internet. And the Blair Witch, there were internet sites. Very few of them to begin with. Like, really, if you go into the library to check something oh, out, it oh, better be important. But there were rumors that this was a true story, and that's how they marketed it and until it came out, and then kind of people found out. But you, I would remember going online and looking this up, and still not sure. When I went and saw this in the theaters, I wasn't sure if it was real or not. Because of the mark, because at the time, there was no debunking even on the internet. We should look you it up. Have multiple right views. now, we should look it up right now. Well, right now, everybody knows it's fake. How do you know? I just put the movies up like last year. Alright. Uh, let's see. Eight, seven. We're on number six. Who are you gonna call? Ghostbusters! Ghostbusters. Another movie that oh, yes. is funny but scary. Oh my god. It's funny but scary. And um, I don't know if anybody saw the, the Ghostbusters 2, to tell you the truth. The second I one? saw a lot of commercials. No, that's the, that's, that's the third one. Insurance and That's cars. the third one. The one with the girls, that's the third one. The second one is the one with the same oh, people. Oh, I like this next one. But it's like but when, the, when the guy okay. takes the baby. What? When the guy takes the baby. That's the second one. The third one is the one with the girls and like Jen. No. Jim Curry, oh, that's right. This is Ghostbusters. We're already in Ghostbusters. Like, what number did they have? All of them. All of them. Three. Okay. All of them have been like on Saturday Night Live, and one of them was yeah. in Gilmore Girls, which is like yeah, Saturday Night, 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 Night Live tends to have a kind of a monopoly on certain movies and getting all of the actors in. I wanted to see Ghostbusters, but I don't know if it's in theaters anymore. I really wanted to see it so bad. Number five. The Shining. The Shitting. It's very scary. The Shining. Um, what does The Shining even mean? Have you seen the movie? Yes. It's explained in the movie. I, mean, I don't want to get no spoilers here. But the book, this is, can we I believe. The light? No, can we get cool? No, no. no. Cool. <laughs> so The Shining, now, the book. Was, uh, was better. And there are a lot of Stephen King movies out there, but this is the only one that is on my top ten list of Halloween movies to watch. We, we own another Stephen King one. It's It. It's, it's very it. scary. That um, movie, they're coming out with a remake, too, for next year. Really? Yes. Oh, yeah, Tootie told me about it last year. Oh. <laughs> if you guys are true Maze Runner fans, um, um, that one? 
Um, in 2018, the death cure comes out. So. Captain Random there. Like, you know, like, you don't okay. even know. Like, I'm so excited because, like... <laughs> Number four. Now we're getting into the meat of things that, where you need to watch these movies during Halloween or around Halloween, October. <gasps> 24 days left. E.T. Number one, it is a fantastic movie, but as a personal aside, it has my girlfriend in it. Anybody, any male of my age will tell you that they all had a crush on Drew Barrymore. I, li- I liked her in the movie Blended. Which, She's um, about my age. With, uh, um, what's his name? Uh, I forgot his name. How did I forget? Adam Sandler. Blended. I love that movie. It's hilarious. With the kids. She's in it, yes. And in Africa. That's hilarious. Mm-hmm. Number three. Yeah, that should be number one. Ooh, see, now we're getting, uh, now we're having a debate. Now we're talking about, instead of talking about movies that are going to happen next year in the we sucks, watched, we watched, that aren't even Halloween, now... Top three movies. Now we're getting into the, the meat of everything. You know, we got E.T. Reading. top th- at number four. Uh, Nightmare on Elm Street. Just spoiler, uh, spoiler alert. It's, it's pretty scary. It's, it's a little scary. Anybody that can kill you in your dreams? Is like super powerful. It's pretty scary. Yeah. That came out when I was a child too. And if any male or female of my yeah. generation will tell you Freddy Krueger has got to be the scariest thing ever thought of. Because then you would watch the movie and then what? Then Wait, you spoil it, go to sleep. Spoil it. Literally. Spoil it. A fear of dying. Pause this I watched part and skip it. Okay? Pause this part and skip it. If you haven't seen this, this movie because it's spoiled. It. Okay. So. At the end, like when they killed it, when they take out the eyeballs, that's seriously. Like, you might want to do oh, this. That's right, the remake. Right. That's the remake, Audrey. That's the original. We watched the remake. You haven't and seen the, the original. The original. Yeah. Just to tell you, don't really watch the remakes. All Careful right, the remakes. I think all of these, the top three movies here. We own the remake. Have all been remade. Number what? two. That should be like number psycho. 10. I hate Psycho. It's like so Why? boring. It's just boring. Do you realize that this movie was known because of one particular scene that was the most controversial scene in the entire movie? When and the guy was dressed up as a girl because that was that. that like, not even like that. Illegal that wasn't even the most controversial one. When the, when the guy killed the girl in the shower. Not the most controversial. Because did you know that people have a phobia of um, taking a shower and baths because All of because that? All because of this movie. All because of this movie. But the most controversial scene or image from that movie, apparently, was that it was the first time they ever showed Can a toilet put, Can you put that down? In a movie. <laughs> yes. That did you know that? That has to be on It was the first time. Are you listening? Yeah. It was the first time they ever showed a toilet in a movie, mm-hmm. and there were major protests over that. Are you kidding me? I am not kidding you. She throws a bunch of paper into the, spoiler alert, she throws some paper into the toilet because she's trying to figure out how she can get this money back, blah, blah, blah. Throws the paper in the toilet, they flush the toilet, they show the paper going down, clean toilet from what I can recall. and. That was the most. That was the first time they ever showed a toilet in a major movie. That's True story. Weird. And side note, the woman oh. in this, the major woman, the major female character that does get killed in the shower, Oops. that is the mother of the Spoiler star. Life. That is this. She is the mother of the number one best movie of. Halloween has got to be Halloween. 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 Jamie Lee Curtis is the daughter of Halloween. Halloween. An actress, and I can't remember her name. Halloween. Halloween. Uh, Halloween. Uh, Halloween. Is her name? Halloween. Halloween. Yeah. Scream Queens must run in that family. Oh, Scream Queens. Yeah, that's amazing. That is amazing. That well, please remind me. Oh, there is a show called Scream Queens. Oh, is it like? Is her name? Uh, and Vera Mills. Yes. Yeah. 
Myers. And I'm Michael Myers today. Or is it Janet Lay? Yeah, Janet Lay. Lee. Lee. Leah Lay. Leah. But that's the mother. So there it is. Top ten. I think number the psycho one, should number be one like, is Halloween. Maybe like number five. You think psycho belongs number not number five? It's, it's in your top ten. That's good it's, enough for me. It's alright, but like it's just sort of boring because I don't really like. Shows black, toilets. Like man. I just don't really like black and white movies. Do not like my thing. He unless I'm like, um, sh- unless it's The Wizard of Oz. But the toilet looks better black and white. And when he it does, 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 does it, the white. scene doesn't work You're unless it's black. That and white. up there, like that. So, what do you think? You your like What's your Indian. favorite movie of um, Halloween? Bring them all up. She needs to consult my list. I'm going to go through those ones at first well, and find my favorite. All right. Well, let's say goodbye then. I was... Hold on. Goodbye. I found my favorite one. Good. I found goodbye. my favorite one. Um, one of my favorites. Which... Oh, what is Even it? Though the, I conjuring, it like the Conjuring. The and Conjuring or Halloween or Nightmare on Elm Street. Those three are my top three. Okay. So this was this was pretty scary. Audrey like, is over there looking at it. She's off stage trying like to find some particular Like, do you not see this little girl crying? Movie. She's such a good actor. I mean, actress. Like, like, do you not see this? She's like so scared. Are you looking for fire starter? Right, right there. She's well, such a good actress. We already watched it. All right. Well, thanks for watching. Thanks for uh, like oh, liking. Oh, no, no, I know my worst ones. I know my worst friends. There's Just, her number. That's her top two Annabelle, right there. Annabelle. Top two. Oh my God, you're crazy. These are the worst. The worst. Oh, okay, that's good. Yeah. Okay. Well, thanks for watching. 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 Thanks for watching.